Hello and welcome to another episode of opening some trading cards but as you can see in front of us today it's a bit different as I have purchased some Animal Crossing amiibo cards um two reasons really one these things got really really popular and weirdly valuable um recently so I thought hey you know what while you can still get like unopened packs for a reasonable price um and just for thing if anyone does want these they're still on the UK Nintendo store I think um, and partly because I want to capitalise on the popularity of Animal Crossing because uh, it's everywhere on YouTube and social media at the moment. So in front of us today I have bought um, a Series 1 binder along with the Series 1 pack. Uh, there are no single Series 1 cards on Nintendo's store unfortunately. So just got this and I've got 5 packs of Series 2 and 5 packs of Series 3. Now I have bought a few packs of these previously. Um, I didn't get anything crazy I don't think anyway. I haven't actually checked online to see what valuable cards there are. What I'm going to do um, as I'm opening these up, if I do happen to pull any like particularly rare or valuable cards, I'll put it on the side or whatever. Um, the only card I know that's worth a lot is in Series 2, there's an Anchor card. Anchor's the kind of mummy cat thing. Um, and she, she's she, she's pop, she's popular because of furries, I think, is is the consensus I can find online. Uh, anyway, I've rambled enough. I'm going to put these to the side and we'll crack open this album. So I kind of wanted an album anyway because um, I have... Ooh, okay. I have my other uh, Animal Crossing Amiibo cards in a Pokemon binder and it, just, it doesn't gel very well. So this can hold 100 cards as there's 100 cards in every um, booster set. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to get to all um, 100 from Series 1 or anything, so... Ooh, okay, this is very weird. Um, oh, oh, okay. Ah, okay, I, so I think this may be a legitimately custom folder. Um, so that shows all the cards, and well, I'm guessing the first half. Um, and yeah, I guess between each page is a small sheet to tell you what villager and stuff they are or like you know uh interesting okay well i do have a tom nook and a mr resetti card actually as it happens um okay this isn't gonna look quite as amazing as i thought i was kind of hoping this would be a clear folder um but whatever i mean at a push i suppose i could remove these or whatever um but that's not really important at the moment uh what it ooh. Oh, and we ha also have a little backing thing explaining Happy Home Designer um, and how it kind of works with the 3DS. Remember when you had to buy the dongle for the 3DS if it wasn't a new 3DS or something? It was. I never. I never got um, Happy Home Designer. I did buy Amiibo Festival, which is the Wii U game. That was purely because you got an Isabel and a Digby Amiibo, and they were selling for like five pound. Anyway, I'm so. These packs are slightly annoying to open because you've got to, got to tear there. So I'm actually just going to use scissors to cut along the top. Uh, make sure I don't cut into the cards. That's always a, it's always a good thing to try and do. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, just above the cards. That was frightening. Right, so um, in these packs, I do believe it says somewhere that I've cut off probably. Um, basically, you get three cards. You get two villagers and one special card. So the special card is like Tom Nook, Rossetti, Isabel, uh, people like that, basically. So um, I don't really know what I'm looking for. I wouldn't mind pulling some villagers I had in the Wii version and New Leaf on the 3DS. But, you know, I'm not, I'm not desperate to get any particular ones, really. Uh, oh, also, we have this exciting health and safety card, which I love. Uh, right. So let's begin with Nox, who's number forty-seven, and a chicken in a in a knight's outfit. That's pretty cool, actually. I have se oh, okay. These are stuck together quite a lot. Fair enough. Uh, oh, yo, Quilson. I'm pretty sure Quilson was a villager in the Wii version, I believe, that I had. Obviously, um, everyone's experience is going to be different. Very nice. Okay, and our rare uh, is Mr. Resetti, who I actually already have. So, I may give this to a friend, I think. Also, on the back, as you can see, there's a bit of a silvery bit. That's where the Amiibo chip is, basically, in these cards. Um, it is it is kind of crazy to think that these chips are so thin that they just fit in a card. But, uh, hey, not bad. 
Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna move everything for a second because it looks a bit messy, and then we'll start on series two and then series three. BRB. Alrighty, I'm back. I've zoomed in a little bit as well because the uh, the, the folder took up a lot of space, but these packs won't. So, um, looking at it, the special cards, one that I quite like is Isabel in her autumn outfit, which is quite cute. Uh, KK Slider, uh, it's not Reese. it's her, is his uh, wife, I can't remember her name, honestly. I uh, wouldn't mind Pumpkin Dude, and I can't remember his name either, Jesus Christ, I'm suddenly like such a casual fan. Um, let's see, ah, there's the comedian guy from the Wii One, uh, Rossetti, or is that the other one? There's two of them, isn't there? Um, oh, yo, that's... Is that Captain? No, that's like his son or something, isn't it? The, one of the people on the island in New Leaf. Anyway, um, yeah, well, I mean, th there's a hundred cards in these set. I bought five packs each. So, uh, five times three, I believe, is 25 each. So, wait, hang on. Yeah, five times three? No, it's 15. Uh... <laughs> I'm an idiot. Anyway, let's put this to the side. Uh, thankfully, unlike Pokemon cards, there is no card trick, and I think I've just seen something pretty cool. It is Agent S. Now, I've actually kind of liked the look of Agent S for a while, because he's like a superhero kind of thing. Um, he might be a reference to Kamen Rider as well, apparently, which is pretty cool. That's quite a nice pull, honestly. Uh, oh, we have Gladys. I don't think we've ever seen Gladys before or heard about her, but she's very cute. A peacock. And obviously, these so these symbols here as well, if you're curious, they play into um, Amiibo Festival, which is the Wii U game. There was like a board game where these cards would roll things, I think, and you'd guarantee a roll. It was, it was weird. And there was a special one. Hey, there we are. Ah, Lella. Lella? Yeah, Lella. Okay, cool. Um, that is... Oh, actually, she was on the front, wasn't she? Was she? Hang on. Yes, she... Wait, no. Yes, no, she is. Yeah, there's Lella. There we are. Cool, we got one of the poster things. Also, I don't know if you can see, but there's a bit of a hollow effect with these cards. All the special ones have, like, mild... They're a bit like star foils from Yu-Gi-Oh, I think, is the best way to do it. I'm going to open one of these packs traditionally, like that. But like, it's a pain because then you've kind of got to, you've got to open, oh actually, never mind, I remember the glue being a lot worse than this. Uh, I still prefer the cut because it looks a bit cleaner. But anyway, let's flip it round, put the health and safety thing to the side and begin with another villager. Ooh, it's Hum Humphrey. Oh, okay, um, he is number 105. Wait, no, uh, 195, sorry. I was going to say then because I think the first like 20 in the set are the special villagers, I think. Uh, next up, we have Marcel. I like, mime dog, maybe. I don't, that is, that's a slightly off-putting dog. Isn't it? Is it just me? I don't know. That that look. It basically looks like he. It's a dog that's seen the Joker, but only like part way, and it was a really sunny day, and you couldn't quite make out the makeup. And <gasps> yo, it's Label. Hey, hello. So Label obviously makes a big appearance in New Horizons. Um, it's also a really, really touching backstory between the Able sisters. Um, keep keep talking. Keep talking to Sable. And you, man, it, it like it's it genuinely was quite touching. Anyway, label very cool. I don't remember label in New Leaf to be honest. Um, undoubtedly I came across her somewhere. Um, wait, wait, was she like? Did she have something to do with the whole like custom designs or something? I can't remember. Label in New Horizons anyway kind of appears in your town square sometimes and gives you like clothes challenges or something. She'll give you some clothes and ask you to match it with some other clothes or something. Uh, anyway, we are two packs down. Right, I'm going to open it like this, actually, so you don't get a peek along with me until we flip it round. Ooh, Ruby! Hey, I just realised Ruby is wearing a T-shirt of herself. Okay, that's uh, slightly egotistical, but whatever. Um, ah, oh, I, I feel like... A friend had Ruby in their village? She's very cute. Anyway, that's, um, might genuinely use this card, because I used to have two rabbits, and they were both, um, 
Himalayan rabbits, I think, and they were kind of albino because they were white with red eyes, like she is. That's very cute. Oh, and next one. Hey, Coach! Another one I've heard a lot of and never had as a villager, but he's cool. He's a jock type, obviously. You can kind of tell by his look. Number 126. And our, I was going to say rare, our special card. Hey, Don! There we go. Oh, wow, we've got two... Um, Two characters featured on the packs now then, I guess. Where's that pack? Oh, hang on. There we go. Also, I was wrong. Sorry, Liebel is on the front pack. I imagine, actually, all of the other ones on the front packs are the special characters, maybe? And, like, obviously, the ev everyone else is just the villager. Yeah, there's Don. Lovely. I can put him with my Mr. Rossetti card. I finally have my full set of the Rossetti brothers. Um, actually, is Don related to Mr. Rossetti? I I never really like because the thing is I, I obviously I didn't reset my game much because or without saving rather I didn't turn my game off without saving much because why would I? But I I don't know maybe maybe he shows up or something I can't remember anyway let's flip this round more health and safety if anyone's interested in some spare health and safety cards by the way hit me up and let's begin with jay who is a blue jay get it because he's a bird and he's blue and his name is jay and a blue jay is a is a bird so um yeah the, the naming conventions on some of these animal crossing villages is fantastic next up oh yo it's coco the like the weird i it, basically, it looks like a hollowed out coconut, but is a bunny or something? It's I don't I don't know how I feel about Coco. She's kind of cute, but also a little bit a little bit terrifying. Cause um, are those her eyes and her mouth? Why is she always in awe? Also, is she wearing like aerobics stuff and yogurt pants? Oh, oh okay, that's fine. Uh, ah, now a special card is oh yo is Blanca. Uh, not to be confused with the green dude from Street Fighter. Nice! Now, I actually never played the DS game, I'm sorry to say, so... I know, I know. Um, but yeah, I know Blanca was uh, a character in that, that you could, like, draw on its face. Uh, I'm gonna say it, because I don't know... Is Blanca a guy or a girl? I mean, well, I suppose Blanca's whatever you want to make of that weird cat thing. Very nice. Okay, cool. We've pulled quite a few cats. Uh, a few bunnies as well, which is quite cute. So, let's put this to the side there. And our last Series 2. Now, I'd really like to pull Isabel in the Autumn outfit. That would be a great way to end this. However, I appreciate uh, there's... Well, I mean, uh, Blanca was number 114, which, uh, which implies, obviously, there's at least 14 special cards. So I've got something like a 1 in 11 chance, if it's not a double, so I don't know. Anyway, let's flip it round. And we have Gabby. Man, all the rabbits today. Um, yeah, very cute. Never seen Gabby before. Not ringing a bell at all, really, but kind, kind of cute. Um, not sure what's going on with the hair, then. Gabby is a girl, I presume, with the name. But, okay. Uh, now, I'm, I'm trying to, like make sure that I'm pulling the middle one because these are really like well held together and the other one is Pete very nice is that sorry I thought that was some kind of like Chinese characters or something on his top then it wasn't but yeah there's Pete he's looking worried very worried actually um to be fair mind with hair like that can you blame him and oh a special card he is copper very nice, one of the two dogs. Unfortunately, that was no Isabel, but it is still a dog. Uh, not quite as cute, but I'll take it. Right, well, that wraps up series two. Um, I'm gonna put those to the side for a second and then I'll start on these. Just showing off my collection of uh, health and safety leaflets there. Or oh, actually, they may not be health and safety things. I don't know exactly what they are. Anyway, so let's jump into series three. Now there is a series four. However, I think they were printed in smaller quantities and they're quite rare now because there was none I could find. And I saw like five packs of Series 4 going for something like £40, which is quite a lot of money. Anyway, so what have we got in Series 3? We've got Digby in his uh, raincoat, which is adorable. We've got uh, Mabel. Very, I'd like a Mabel card. Uh, we've got um, Isabel in a Yukata. Um, oh, sorry, Kimono or Yukata, either one. Um, 
Hey, I can't remember his name, but there's that cat. You got um, Tom Nook. Is yeah, that is Tom Nook dressed up somehow. I think either Timmy or Tommy. I'm I'm sorry, I can't tell the difference. We've got the uh, the birds. We got Blathers, Leaf, Reese, um, oh, Christmas dude. Uh, that's the mail delivery guy. That that's Don again. Is Don in all of these? Um, it's weird that you don't have a double Mr. Rossetti. And that's Captain's wife, I believe, or whatever. So I'm presuming Captain is in series one then, which is a shame. I'd have loved a Captain card, but yeah. Uh, right, okay, cool. Well, I'll stop looking at the uh, packaging now and actually get into it. Um, yeah. So I didn't pull anything super rare in Series 2, I don't think. I could be wrong though, if I put a caption that it was rare, then I am wrong and don't listen to me. Listen to the words that I write instead. Right, let's begin. Series 3. We have Flora. Oh, is that a flamingo? Oh, there's actually a flamingo. I, I didn't know you could have a flamingo villager. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, well, it looks like a flamingo. It's probably just like a bird slash turkey villager, but... She's meant to look like it. Flora, very cute. Ooh, we have Wolfgang. Damn, that is... If ever I saw a kind of Sasuke pose, that is... That is completely what he is doing. He he, he seems like a pretty cool dude. Um, ah, I, there are, like, characteristic types, aren't there, for villagers? He doesn't strike me as a grumpy type, but who knows? Anyway, who will be our... Spe hey, it's Timmy! There we are. I've got Tom Nook and I've got Timmy. Do I have Tommy? No, because he was in Series 2. Very cute. He's got his uh, apron on from like the upgraded Nook's cranny, I believe. Um, obviously, these so these designs, I'm guessing, are kind of based on New Leaf, which is the 3DS game. Um, obviously, the, you know, there are some, like Blanca, I, unless I really missed something, did not appear in New Leaf, so... You know, some of these are new renders and stuff. But anyway, let's get back to it with Daisy. Hey. Uh, now, I did get Goldie as an amiibo card for getting the Wii U game. Because you get three three cards. There's Rosie, Goldie, and someone else, and I can't remember. Very cute. Never seen Daisy before. Let's get on to Miranda. Um, another duck I have never seen before. Um, oh, I genuinely thought for a second there was question marks. I was like... What? Have I pulled like some super rare? No, I haven't. She's just two, two, two. Very cool. All right then. And the secret, uh, the uh, the special. Hey, special card is Phyllis. She's the not so nice one that takes over in the night or like after eight p.m. or something in the post office. Um, yeah, very nice. Man, you know, I kind of miss the post office in Animal Crossing. I know it's a lot easier now by going to the Dodo Airlines thing and you can just send a letter. Um, I don't know, there was kind of charm though of physically going to the post office and everything. Because that's who played your mortgage off, isn't it, in the post office, I think. Um, and that's just a town hall function now. I mean, I am appreciating everything's a bit more streamlined in New Horizon, so I can't complain. Right. Let's begin with uh, Victoria. Ah, oh, that. Okay, I'm 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 getting very mixed vibes. I can't tell if Victoria's meant to be like um, an athlete, kind of like a, a runner, or a luchador, because she's wearing a luchador mask. But I don't know the the top looks very kind of marathon runner esque. Yeah, Victoria, a horse. You know, I've never had a horse villager. I'd like a horse. Uh, next up, ew. Is Freckles the duck? My my goodness, Freckles is correct. That duck has freckles. And what is up with duck hair? All of the ducks I have seen have never had great hair. Um, just don't give them hair, man. Just just leave them bald. They're ducks. They don't need hair. Uh, right. Our next. Oh, can we get the other pelican from the post office? No, we can't. Hey, Rover. That's my boy. So Rover. Um, appeared at the start of City Folk, or in the UK actually, uh, Animal Crossing City Folk was called Animal Crossing, let's go to the city. Which doesn't, it, it, it doesn't sound as good to be honest and I don't understand. But there we are, and that's, that's pretty cool. I'm liking that Rover card. Um, I, I like what they do with these packs, which is you get like two villagers who there's a chance you'll really like or a chance you'll have never heard of. Um, which is true for a lot of these in my case, actually. But 
it's nice you get a special card so like you never you never pull a pack and be like who is that well i suppose unless you've not played animal crossing much uh because some of the seasonal special people like sort of the reindeer at christmas you could have missed that and you've been like who's this then uh oh let's begin with blanche Named after that woman in Streetcar Named Desire, I think. I've never read it, but I've, I've heard of it. Very cute. Uh, Blanche is also like white, I believe, and it's a white um, turkey kind of villager, so very fitting. <gasps> Yo, Costo! <laughs> All right then, Costo was in uh, my, my new leaf uh, town, and he was awesome. He is a French frog, as you can tell from his name and the fact he's got a, like a French moustache kind of stereotype thing. Um, now that I think of it, it is a little bit mean, maybe, that his name is Costo and he is a frog, because obviously, uh, you know, a derogatory term for French people is frogs. Um, <laughs> but okay, I really liked Costo though, he was really chill. Um, he, he was always up for a laugh. And he doesn't have... I can't tell if that's a hair, hair or another one of his spots, because he's got spots. I'm going to choose it as being a spot. And think he... Oh, wait, no, yeah, it's the ducks are the weird hair. Yeah, frogs don't have hair. Obviously, because frogs don't have hair. Ducks do have hair, or plumes, sometimes. Who is our special... It's Rover again. All right, then. I think uh, one of my friends shall be receiving two mystery amiibo cards in the mail, unless they've watched this, in which they, they know what card they're getting. Okay, cool. Well, let's end on a high, shall we? If I can pull Meeble... Mabel, Digby or Isabel would be a phenomenal way to end this video, but I'm assuming not. Oh hell, one, vi one more villager that I have seen. Um, maybe a villager from New Horizons. Um, obviously they're all the same villagers, but like Bam would be cool. The Blue Deer. Let's see. No, we do... <laughs> oh wow, we have Chrissy who... It took me a second because it looked like she was crying. I think it's a she. Well, I presume Chrissy. Um, yeah, and with the eyes and the eyelashes and stuff. It's a very cute rabbit. How many rabbits are there? I know, they, aren't there like eight or ten of the animals? And I think like each one has a different personality type or something. I'm not fully sure. Anyway, uh, our last chance of a villager is Francie My. I am pulling all of the rabbits today, apparently. This must be the fifth rabbit now. Um, very cute, though. I, I, I've never had a rabbit villager, and I do like rabbits. So maybe maybe I'll introduce one of these rabbits onto my island uh, in terms of uh, to get rid of maybe Canberra. She's kind of cute, but she's a koala, and, uh, you know, she's okay. And our final card, will it be something hype? <gasps> it, ooh, yo, it's Pete. There we are. Okay, cool. So it's not... It's not one of the three I, like, really wanted. Um, I'm sure I could probably buy them for decent price online. Um, yeah, very cute. Pete is the guy who you see physically walk around and deliver your mail, which is very nice. And occasionally he'll have, like, a parcel for you or something. Um, although, not so much in New Horizons, again, is something I remember. Because you just get them from online and stuff hmm that's kind of made me a bit sad now well anyway thank you very much for watching um this has just been a sort of slightly self-indulgent -indul uh, opening of some animal crossing packs and stuff because well i they're trading cards and hey what else are we gonna do whilst we're stuck indoors shit i've dated the video now when you're watching this in like July 2020, you'll be like, hey, wait a second, he mentioned being locked indoors in the end of April, and we're still locked indoors now. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Um, I have quite a few videos lined up, actually. Um, as I mentioned in my 250 subscriber special, I've moved house, so I, I've not been able to do stuff for quite a while, but now I'm kind of all back into it, so expect to see quite a lot of videos uh, coming up shortly or whatever. Um, and yeah, let me know in the comments who is your favourite villager. Um, I genuinely want to hear things because uh, Animal Crossing is a phenomenal game to hear other people's experiences playing and stuff. Uh, anyway, I've rambled on enough now. I shall see you guys again in the next video. And until next time, goodbye.